This video will explain the process for replacing the fuel oil filter on your EnergyLogic waste oil furnace system. The oil filter should be changed after every 800 to 1000 hours of operation or when the vacuum gauge reads 5 inches of mercury higher than readings taken with a clean filter. You'll need the following tools. A filter wrench, safety glasses, a pair of gloves, and some rags to catch any excess oil. It's important to use only EnergyLogic certified parts on these systems. You'll need the EnergyLogic spin-on fuel filter. Step 1. Turn the fire stop valve clockwise to close. Or, close the ball valve at the head of the filter housing. Step 2. Spin the filter off of the filter head assembly counterclockwise. Drain and dispose of the fuel filter properly. Step 3. Clean any debris from the aluminum filter housing. Step 4. Fill the new filter with non-synthetic auto transmission fluid to quicken the priming process. Do not use new motor oil or synthetic transmission fluid. Rub some of the transmission fluid on the new filter gasket. Step 5. Once filled, spin the filter clockwise onto its housing and hand tighten. Be careful not to cross thread. Step 6. Open the fire stop valve or the ball valve. Step 7. Record the meter hours and date on the new filter. This will help you adequately measure rising mercury levels throughout the life of the filter. Your system is now ready to be primed. For other instructional videos and more information about our products, visit us at energylogic.com.